Welcome again. So this time I want to go over the Sensational Star and Shooting Star Awards. You scared? Yeah. Um, there's a document in the workstation. You can just search for Sensational Start and it'll come up. It is uh, the Earn the Sensational Start and Shooting Star Awards with the six skills of the selling system. So it's a document. It's got, I don't know, 11-ish, 12 pages maybe. And it's, um, some of you may not like to read, but I really encourage you to read this because um, it has a lot of really good information. I'll kind of go through it here and touch on things, but um, it's not its not actually a whole lot of reading, honestly. It's some, but it's not like a ton. Like you can see, it's not a ton of reading. So, first of all, if you haven't been told yet, um, when you first join Cincy within your first 15 days and within your first 70 days, you have a chance to earn a couple of different awards that Cincy offers. So the first award is called the Shooting Star Award. Um, I'm gonna go by the chart here, the chart's right in the document, um, and it says that for the Shooting Star Award, you have 15 days to sell 500 PRV. Um, if you don't know what PRV is, uh, just a quick kind of rundown is, um, usually it is one point of PRV per $1. The only stipulations or the only, um, I can't think of the word, the only time that that is not going to happen is when you have a cause item, something that's licensed, or the whip box. Because the whip box, you get more value than you're paying for. Um, and then the licensed items, we since he has fees that they have to pay for those um, to be able to use their, uh, you know, logos and anything like that, their names, basically. So um, it's slightly lower, although quite honestly, it's not a huge difference. The biggest difference you're gonna see probably is like five points difference, which is not a lot at all. It's just like the whip box. You pay 30 bucks, you get 25 PRV. Not a big difference, so it's pretty cool. Um, anyways, within your first 15 days, if you sell uh, 500 PRV, you've earned the Shooting Star Award. Um, now, your 15 days starts, and so does your 70, starts on the day you enroll. So if you enroll one day, um, that's when your first day is of your 15 days. Um, and you can start selling as soon as you join Sensi, as soon as you enroll. You do not have to wait for your kit to come in. Um, you'll get your email, of course, from Sensi. You can set up your website. You can place orders through there. You can also place orders through your workstation, which is going to be available to you as soon as you sign up. So that's the great thing about that. Um, now for the prize or the award, uh, for Shooting Star, you will be um, receiving a Shooting Star charm and charm bracelet or lapel pin. It depends on which you chose, either the charm or the pin. Um, if you're not a bracelet type of person, maybe you want the pins instead. It's up to you. Um, and you also are eligible to earn a Shooting Star kit, uh, enhancement kit that includes deeply discounted products. So you are eligible to earn a kit that is worth over $300 in value, uh, but you only pay $200 for it. And here's the kicker on that. So when you buy this $200 kit, you also earn PRV on that. So not only are you getting way more in value on in your kit, you're also getting 20% of that back to you. Now, within your first 15 days when you earn that, you don't have to buy the kit right off if you don't want to. You have 90 days to purchase that from the time that you earn it. So. You don't have to worry about, oh, you know, it's gonna expire within the next week or so. You have plenty of time to order it, especially you can even use your commission commission from the month before or whatever to earn it so or to uh, buy it. So that's really cool. Um, I will say currently in the Shooting Star kit, I believe there's a deluxe diffuser, six bars, a couple of packs of pods, a couple of oils, um, a mini, or excuse me, a wall fan diffuser, um, two warmers, I think. Counter clean, a buddy clip. There's a ton of stuff in it. And the really good thing about the kit, about purchasing the kit besides, you know, earning PRV on it and all that stuff um, and getting more than you're paying for anyway, is that it gives you a chance, especially if you have not been able to as of yet, to try multiple, multiple different Cincy products. Maybe, maybe you don't have a diffuser and oils. Maybe you don't have a wall fan diffuser or maybe you haven't tried our clean, our clean line yet. Um, this gives you the chance to do just that. So it's awesome. I, I 
making hamburger while I make this video, in part to prove a point, which is no matter how busy you are, you can certainly work your Cincy business. You just have to make it work for you in the time frame that you have available. I'll turn you a little bit so you can see me. So, me and my daughter are sitting here. I'm making some hamburger for taco meat. She's watching a movie and running around crazy sometimes. And I am getting this done. So, we'll put the lid back on that. I sound like I'm doing a cooking show, don't I? Just kidding. All right, so let's move on here. Oh, I'm using Jordan's cup. Because I need a drink. Okay, so um, that's Shooting Star. Now, you also have the opportunity within your first 70 days as a consultant to earn sensational start level one, two, and three. Um, for level one, your requirements, uh, here, uh, I'll tell you your qualifications and then your award that goes with it uh, that you earn. So your qualifications are either, you have a choice here, either you sell 1500 PRB within your first 70 days. Now 70 days is a lot. So that's like what, over two months, about two and a half months to sell Scentsy. Um, and especially if you can earn that 500 PRV within your first 15 days and get Shooting Star, that counts towards your 1500. So you're already a third of the way there. So you can definitely do this. Don't get, don't, don't worry about it. You got this. Um, and I know it can be done because I did it when I joined also. So, um, so you can either sell 1500 PRV within your first 70 days, seven zero, um, or you can sell 500 PRV and one and have one personally enrolled consultant who reaches 200 PRV in customer sales. So let's break that down a little bit. So you can sell 500 PRV, then you enroll someone who is your frontline. Um, they will enroll on your website um, and they reach 200 PRV. Now, all this has to be done within the qualification period of the 70 days. There is a little thing here that says your personally enrolled consultant must be active or earn that 200 PRV. That's what we call active for the month as you've got 200 PRV for the month. Um, earn that PRV, earn that 200 PRV within one month by the end of the month of your 70, 70th day. So if you have your 70th day um, in May, let's show I'm just saying May. Um, if, as long as they are active from sometime from the time you join up until the month, any time in the month of May, even if your 70th day is May 1st, um, as long as they're active in one of those months, including May, May could be the month they're active. Hold on a second, okay? Uh, then you will earn Sensational Start Level 1. No, oh, baby. Mm -mm. You don't need anything up there. No, ma'am, put that back, please. Well, come here and I'll push some. Um, now, here's the other thing. Uh, first things first, we talked about that in the last video. You need to make sure that you get that checklist done because if you don't, you are not qualified for a sensational start level one, two, or three. So, and it's super simple to do that. You just watch a couple videos and, you know, do what we talked about the other day. Hmm? Mm -mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can do the backs too. You need a little bit more. There you go. Ah, get it. So, let's see here. So, what do you earn? So, you're going to earn $50 product credit. Whoa, hello, right? <laughs> um, you're going to earn your Sensational Start lapel pin. That is a pin. It's always going to be a pin. Um, and then you also get a certificate of achievement. Um, not to mention the PRV, or the, excuse me, the commission that you're going to earn off all that PRV that you sold, right? Sorry, gotta stir the hamburger a little bit. So, um, sensational start level two is slightly different in the qualifications and the awards. Um, so, you what? No, put that back, please. 
You'll need to sell at least 3,000 PRV to customers, or you can sell 1,500 PRV and have one consultant who reaches 200 or goes active. And of course, complete your first things first checklist. And all this is on the chart so you can see it better if I'm not explaining it well enough for you. You can see it here on the chart. Um, for level two, you will earn, no ma'am. For level two, you'll earn $125 product credit. Um, sensational start level one and two pins. Uh, certificates of achievement for level one and two. And you'll also get an exclusive sensational start uh, award warmer. And it's super cute. I don't know if they will ever change it, but I will say that the one that they have is beautiful. It's this white star. I think if you search it on Workstation, you'll probably find an image of it. That way you can um, kind of see it before you earn it. I hope this isn't last in here, but let's do this. So level three is at least either at least six uh, six thousand PRV to customers or three thousand PRV to customers and two this changes a little bit and two personally enrolled consultants those who signed up on your website um with two hundred in sales within one month so you know they went active um that needs to go a little bit longer. Now, for that one, it's really good. You're gonna earn $225 worth of credit and the first things first checklist, I think I said that, but I don't remember. Um, so 225 in product credit, uh, sensational start level one, two, and three pins, certificates of achievement for levels one, two, and three, um, the exclusive sensational start award warmer, plus a trophy, plus recognition on the news tab and at Sensi Family Reunion. What oh, baby? It's okay. You'll be all right. I don't know. Okay. Okay, go find them. Uh, so, Cincy Family Reunion, if you didn't know, is a, it's our big, big, <laughs> big um, event that we have every year. So, we have World Tour which is a smaller event and it's in a lot more different places. But since, uh, excuse me, Cincy Family Reunion is the, our big one event. Um, usually we have one in each region. We have re regions one, two, and three. Region one is US and Canada. Um, region two and three are other countries that are overseas. Um, and this year it's gonna be a little bit different because Cincy Family Reunion is going to go virtual since we've been having um, all the uncertainty around um, events and large groups of people being together and stuff like that because of, you know, the pandemic that's been going on. Um, so it's going to be virtual this year, which means that everybody's going to get to go. You don't have to worry about traveling anywhere. It's kind of sad because we can't get, we won't be able to see each other in person like, like us and then people who may live states away that we haven't seen in a long time or even in Canada that we haven't seen in a long time. Um, but it's really cool that everybody's going to get a chance to go this year. Um, you can see, we'll have more information on that as it comes, um, but it's really, really cool to get recognized at Cincy Family Reunion, so that's really awesome. So those are the um, qualifications and the awards that you get for Shooting Star and Sensational Start Levels 1, 2, and 3. Um, again, this is on the workstation and it's really easy to follow, so if you want to take a look at it again to see all that, you can. It also is in your consultant guide, which you probably got when you joined. I think some of the uh, smaller kits like the 20 or $15 kits did not have the consultant guide. However, all you have to do is search consultant guide on the workstation and you'll find that there. So as for everything else that's in this little guide here for what baby? We'll get it in a minute, okay? You wanna drink a mommy's? Let's see here. So the next page here gives us a little bit of 
information on you know the different ways to earn PRB. So home parties, basket parties, fairs and trade shows, um, fundraisers, online parties, one-on-one -on -one appointments, sit and sniffs, um, and just different types of you know ways to get PRB and, and parties that you can do. Um, the great thing, I keep saying the great thing about it, but there's so many great things, you know, it just is what it is. Um, one of the great things about owning your own business is you can run it how you want to. Yes, we have a set of standards we need to follow. That's true. But you don't have to do all of these different things. My recommendation is to pick one that you think would suit you and your time and your needs and things like that and um, go with it, master it. Then you can move on to something else so you can master the next thing. Um, home parties right now is not a big thing that we're doing and usually for a launch party we would recommend to do a home party only because the normal um, average PRV that you would earn on a home party is going to be around 500 which would help you to earn shooting star and um, get you well on your way for sensational start. However, again, things are a little bit different right now. So um, we also recommend um, online parties. Online parties are the big thing right now. There's actually a um, another document on the workstation that, said, that is the ultimate online 30-minute part party guide. And it literally gives you step-by-step-by-step -by -step -by -step instructions for um, running an online party. And not only does it give you step-by-step -step instructions, it also gives you scripts to use with your hosts so you can coach them to a very successful party. And because right now, Jordan, will you bring that back, please? Will you bring that back, please? I need a drink. Because um, people are more online, they're seeing things online, they're not able to go out, they're doing a lot of online shopping. Right now, those parties are doing a lot better than they normally would because a lot more people are seeing things online and ordering online. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, tells you the different kind of parties that you can have, different ways you can run your business, basically. No, thank you. I'll get some more in a minute. Thank you. Be careful. Uh, the next page goes over prospecting, um, which is basically just trying to figure out um, or uh, honey, stop, stop. Yeah, you got a big mess. <laughs> it's okay, honey. Here, you want to see it? Help me clean it. It's okay. We'll dry it off. It'll be okay. It's all right, baby. She's got butter everywhere. <laughs> Anyways, prospecting. Um, your customers are seeking something, and your job is to find out what it is. Whether it's great biz, uh, fragrance, home decor, free and half price products, or the opportunity to run their own business. It's okay. Put it right there. Go put it over the vent, okay? Um, how to do it, you know, complete your list of 100 that's in your consultant guide. Again, if you don't have a physical consultant guide, that's okay. Um, you can just write it down on a piece of paper. Make sure that you keep it somewhere where you can, you know, refer back to it. Huh? Okay, thank you. Uh, talk to people, right? <laughs> that's the number one thing. Talk to people. Um, ask about guest families. Use social media. Get out there. Strike it up. Strike up some conversations. What, honey? What? No, here. Can I see Now be careful, okay? Take a drink. Uh, social media, you've got the marketing tab that you can use that has bunches yeah. of images on there. Um, if you have your own Scentsy, I do recommend that you use that so people can really see, um, instead of seeing a bunch of stock images, they can also see your images and how you're using it. Although the stock images are really good, I'm just gonna let you know right now. Okay, you gonna drink all the drinks? Okay, I love you, be careful please. Uh, booking is our next page here. And each of these pages have little uh, side notes on the sides or at the bottom to kind of give you a little pro tips and things like that. Hey, Jordan, Jordan, thank you. Uh, the next one's booking, have parties, ask. Make sure you're asking people to have parties because if you don't ask anybody, nobody's gonna know about that you even want them to you know, host a party. Um, keep your calendar up to date. Make sure that you know what you have available for parties. Um, 
you may have some people come to you and ask you to do a party or, you know, message you or whatever. Um, let's see here. Use the library of party games. If you go on the workstation, they have party games on there as well. If you want to do games, um, they're good sometimes for, um, interaction and parties. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. We're not doing that. You've already got water right here. And then, um... Make sure, I will say, just side note here, if you do a party and you have games there and you want to do some kind of prize, make sure you stay within compliance. We are not allowed to offer free things unless it's samples to people out in the open. So you can always do uh, like a sample goodie pack that you want to send out for a prize, anything like that. Anything free people are going to like anyway, so don't worry. They will love a sample pack. Um, have a booking blitz which is where you get together with a group of consultants, you grab your list of 100 and set a timer for 15 or 30 minutes, and then you see how many that you can contact within those 30 minutes. And, um, Jordan, put that back, please. No, ma'am, put it back, please. Um, and see how many you can book, and everybody just kind of sees how many they can book. Um, and then ask friends on Facebook. You know, take some pictures of what you got. Um, Share it around. If you see somebody who says they like something or, you know, indicates that maybe they can't afford it or anything like that, hey, have you ever thought about hosting a party? We can earn you some free and half off sensing. We can get that warmer half price for you. We can shoot. We might be able to get that warmer free for you, right? So the next one is host coaching. This is basically just telling you that when you have a host who is uh, working, who is, you know, doing a party for you, um, it tells you how to keep up with them and make sure they know what their role is in the party. Because if they, if you don't communicate with them, they may not know. They may have never booked a party, or they may have never, you know, hosted a party before. Um, so it's got steps on how to do that here. And I'm kind of going through it, but really, um, you know, take a look at it. Um, it's it's not as much. Uh, there you go, baby. No, you hear. Um, but kind of, you know, read through it and take a look. Uh, this one is just continuing with host coaching. Presenting uh, your presentation is your opportunity to share your story and experiences along with the products and as a business owner with others. Now, this, um, the host coaching for this and the presenting. Um, and the follow-up, it all kind of goes along with an in-home party because we do recommend in-home parties for the first party. However, um, change it up to make it online, especially right now. Um, and you can totally do that. I love to do Facebook Live parties. Now, I'll do a party, keep it open for a week. I'll, I'll choose a day with my host that I know that she can be there or he um, to, you know, interact with the, with the live video that I'm doing, showing off different products. Um, and I'll post a few days, I'll, I'll post for a few days before and, you know, for the, basically for the whole time frame and kind of ask people what they need more information on, what they want me to talk about, things like that. And then I'll set up a display or I will, um, just go live and show off some different products. So you'll kind of want to change this up to be a, an online party for now until we can, uh, get back to doing things a little more normally and you know doing them in person hmm? yeah uh it's a little bit different but it's a good one too you want to watch that next yeah okay hold on a second okay Uh, the next page is about sponsoring, and I know as a new consultant, it's really super... Uh-oh, we got to find the video, or find the uh, DVD. As a new consultant, it's really maybe a little scary to you, maybe it's not, um, to sponsor a new consultant when you're brand new with this yourself. I didn't sponsor for probably about a year after I joined, and that was just a personal choice, and that can be your choice too. However, okay, we'll do that next. However, I do recommend that if you want to build a team and you really want to make some money with Cincy, that you invite people to join your team and that you um, just be open about it. And, you know, if you if you invite them to the team and you invite them to your team and you want them to, and they join under you, um, we're here to help you. I am making these videos and I'm putting them on YouTube because I want everyone to have access to them. 
so that when you welcome on new consultants, you can um, share with them with your new consultants as well. Nope, it's in there. Hey, no ma'am, no ma'am, no ma'am. We'll get it in a minute, okay? Just wait, please. Almost done, baby, almost done. Um, so here's a couple things, and I, I do wanna go over these just a little bit, not too much. We've already got 25 minutes on this video. Um, never prejudge. You never know who is going to be a rock star in this business. You have no idea ever. They could have never even ever said anything to you about Cincy and they may just automatically say, Hey, I want to join. And you're like, really? Like, I don't even know you like Cincy. Like, do you like Cincy really? Um, you don't know what's been going on in their life. They could have been thinking about this for a year and then all of a sudden they wanted to join, right? Um, never prejudge anybody. You could get rock stars from anyone and it takes one person to change your whole business hold on please no i'm not gonna open it uh let's see here listen make sure you listen when you're hearing people talk about things um i made the example earlier of someone who couldn't afford a, a certain warmer um that also is an indicator that maybe they want to make some extra money right um our one of our um, things that we go by is buy, post, join. Or excuse me, join. <laughs> I already got it messed up. Um, join, post, buy. So ask them if they want, if somebody says they can't afford something, ask them if they want to join and make some extra money, plus being able to, you know, earn their own rewards by doing their launch party and doing other parties that they earn the rewards on themselves. Um, if they don't want to join and they're not really into that idea, um, okay, do you want to host a party, right? Um, they may go for that, especially if they say they can't afford it, right? Um, if they don't go for that, then eventually you'll, then, you know, you'll get to the point where, okay, well, let me know when you are, or, you know, tell me when I can check back with you so that we can, um, get you hooked up with this warmer, you know, if they want to say like when they get paid or something like that. But buy, post, join. Kind of gives you, start at the top, work your way down. And any way you go about it, it could, you know, be really good for your business. Um, be interested in other people. So, this is a good one too. So, you want to be sure that you are not just looking at it as, you know, I want this person to join my team so that I can earn an incentive or so that I can... Um, I don't know, make more money or so that I can do this or that, whatever, right? Um, you want to be interested in what other people need. So we want to give this opportunity to people who need it or to people who want it because there's some people who may not need the money, but maybe they need the community. Maybe they need a hobby. Maybe they need something for themselves, right? Um, it's not about what they can do for you. <coughs> It's about what Cincy can do for them and for their lives. Because as you go on, you'll notice that Cincy is really gonna bless you. And especially if you let it and you do the work to let it. Um, Cincy has really blessed us a lot. It really has, and I'm really, really grateful for it. Um, I was gonna give an example, but I'll have to put the income disclosure statement on there. I'm just gonna do it. Um, so we live in a house where we live very close to a decent sized city. It's not a big city or anything, but you know, we're in West Virginia, <laughs> but, um, and our power goes out all the time. Like, I mean, once a month at least. And so we, I had a really, really good month with Cincy and we finally decided we're going to get a generator. So we got a generator and it was paid for completely with Cincy money. And I had some left over. So income disclosure statement. Um, but, uh, another, what was my other one? Oh, I also earned a uh, an all expenses paid trip uh, cruise to Bermuda. Now, because of the pandemic that's going on, um, we didn't get to go on it. However, instead, since he cashed us out for that, and they cashed out what was it? I think it was seven seventeen hundred. I think it was seventeen hundred that they paid us instead of you know. Just saying, okay, sorry for your luck. We can't go on the cruise. So that was really awesome. Again, see the income disclosure statement. You search on your workstation, you can find it there. Um, and I'll put it in the notes on YouTube. That way everybody can see it. Um, 
So Cincy is a big blessing as long as you let it, as long as you do the work for it. Um, share your story. I just shared a little bit of my story. <laughs> um, but share why you joined Cincy, whether it was community, money, you know, uh, just something to have for yourself, whatever that may be. One day I'll share my Cincy story, um, maybe to put on the YouTube channel, but for right now I'm just going to keep this, you know, short because we're almost done and it's been 30 minutes. So I know, uh, let's get through here. Um, share your story. Your story can impact somebody very, very deeply and you might not ever even know it, but you might, um, have someone join your team because of it and then they tell you and you're you're gonna feel really awesome that you you know impacted somebody like that and had them make a decision based on something that they related to in you and that's just a really cool thing I think um, hand out three possibility packets at every party and it's also got a little list here of what you can put in your possibility packets now I will say let's see here I think all these things are either cheap or very, very easily, uh, you know, gotten. Uh, it's even got some a little key here that tells you where you can find a lot of these items. Um, and it doesn't have to be anything expensive. Just, just like anything with Scentsy, use what you have. You know, if you have a bar and you want to make some felt samples, go for it. Go for it. Felt samples are the cheapest and they work just as well. Um... And then it's just got a little closing thing on the back. So that's all you got there. Now I like to send out to everyone this little chart along with some felt samples and things like that. And a welcome letter. So you should be receiving that soon. I'm just showing them some papers. And again, thank you for watching. This one ran a little bit longer than the other one did, but thank you for watching. I really, really, really am really glad that you joined Cincy. And not because you're on my team, but I'm glad when anyone joins Cincy because it's really blessed our lives and it can really bless your life too. And I'm super excited for you.